What's up, Pack? My name is Wolf21, and this is another Minecraft mod install tutorial. This one is for Optifine. The first thing that we're going to do is we're going to back up your Minecraft folder or files. So the first thing that you want to do is click on the start on the bottom left hand corner of the screen. You're going to search for your programs. You're going to search for percent sign, app data percent sign, and hit enter. It's going to open up your app, app data roaming folder. In here, you're going to see the dots Minecraft folder. You're going to what you're going to do is you're going to double click on the dot Minecraft folder. You're going to see all your Minecraft files within here. What you're going to do is you're going to highlight all these files within here by clicking and dragging over them or hitting Control A on your keyboard. And then you're going to right click and choose copy. The next thing that we're going to do is we're going to right click on your desktop or your place of choosing. Choose new folder and name it MC Backup or whatever you think you're going to remember it as. Double click on that folder to open it up. Right click and choose paste. It's going to copy all of the contents of your Minecraft into that backup folder. Once that is complete, you can close out of that folder. You can go back to the dot Minecraft folder, highlight everything within here and delete all those files. And you can close out of that window. Next thing we're going to do is we're going to launch Minecraft because we're going to have a clean version of Minecraft for you to install the mods. Enter in your username and password. You're going to log in. Minecraft is going to re-download. And Minecraft is downloaded. Make sure it's, this is for Minecraft 1.2.3. You're going to quit game. The next thing that we're going to do is in the link down below is the Optifine HD. This is the install for Optifine HDB standard for Minecraft 1.2.3. Um, there are different versions. There's a smooth and multi-core. Um, you can follow the same directions that I'm using now if you download any of these files. If you care to choose to use other ones, you can, but this one's for standard. Which you, you're going to click on the download link. It's going to be an ad fly link. And then you're going to click on skip, ahead, skip ad in the top right-hand corner of the screen. Then your file is going to download, which is a zip file right here. Next thing that we're going to do is we are going to reopen up your .minecraft folder. So you got to click on the globe in the bottom left-hand corner of the screen. Start and then percent app data percent and hit enter. Go back into your .minecraft folder. Then you're going to double click on the bin folder. In here, you're going to see a Minecraft file. You're going to right click on that. Choose 7-zip. I use 7-zip. The uh, link is down in the description below. It is a free download. You can also use WinRAR, but for all these tutorials, I use 7-Zip because it is a free application. 7-Zip, open archive. It opens up the, the Minecraft jar. The first thing that we're going to do is we're going to delete the meta-inf folder. Click on it once to highlight it and press delete on your keyboard. Confirm delete, hit OK. Next thing, while this is open, the next thing we're going to do is we're going to right click on the Optifine download, zip, choose 7 zip in open archive. It's going to open up that in 7, in 7 zip. You're going to see a whole bunch of class files in here, also one PNG. What you're going to do is once this window is selected, you're going to hit Control A or highlight every single file within here. What you're going to do is you're going to click and drag all these class files over to the left-hand side where the other dot class files are in the Minecraft.jar. You're going to drop it off. You want to confirm file copy. You're going to hit yes. That's going to copy all the class files from the zip over to Minecraft.jar. Now Optifine is installed. To verify that it's installed, you can close out of the zip. Also close out of the Minecraft.jar. You can also close out of the other open folder. We're going to launch Minecraft, log in, no black screen. Way to verify this, you can go to options, video settings, and now you got a whole bunch of different options now. Uh, quality, performance, other, texture packs in here, animations, details, it's, cr it's crazy. 
Um, this is just the install. Uh, if you want to full s render settings and everything else you can do with this mod, just check the link in the description below. This is just to get this installed. How to get your your worlds back into your your saves back into your Minecraft. What you can do is you can close out of Minecraft. Your backup folder, you can open that folder up. In here, you're going to see a saves folder. If you double click on there, you're going to see a bunch of folders, which are your worlds that you have downloaded. You can copy those, right click and choose copy. And then to get back to your Minecraft, you click on start, go to percent app data percent. Go back into your dot Minecraft folder, your saves, right click and choose paste. And now your world is back into your dot Minecraft folder. Again, this is a clean version of Minecraft. All the mod install tutorials are clean versions. Usually if it any mods change anything within the world itself, you need a new world. It will just automatically generate in your previous world unless it's actual characters like mo creatures or more creeps and weirdos and stuff like that. But that was the install for Optifine for Minecraft version 1.2.3. If this has helped you out, if you can please leave a like, a favorite, a comment below. It is very much appreciated for the support. For doing these mod tutorials. My name is Wolf21. Links are down below also. And always remember to rock on.